Hi, I don't know whether you remember, but I was given for Christmas Marion Key's Grown Ups. I've never read any Marion Keys before, and it was a charming, dysfunctional family saga that she she wrote. Oh, uh, Irish, and it, she's it's, it's an Irish family beautifully dysfunctional Irish family and it's a, a, a long book it's it's a you know, it's a, a 600 pager but you fly through it and it focuses on the Casey family you've got Johnny you've got Ed you've got Liam three brothers and their wives Johnny is married to Jesse Ed is married to Cara and Liam is married to Nell who incidentally is his second wife Jesse is the owner of an exotic grocery store. She has this um, range of shops throughout Ireland. She creates um, workshops where she brings well-known chefs in. And she's very wealthy. And Johnny who is incidentally her second husband, is wealthy as, as part of this. You know, he's, it's, it's the family wealth. Jessie is a spender. She lives for family and she is, thinks that the only way to keep the family together is through money. She creates these huge family occasions, birthdays, get togethers, and she pays for everything. She pays for the hotel, she pays for the food, she pays for everything because she thinks that it's important to keep family together. It's also a sign of her insecurity a little way because she she thinks that the only way that people will like her is if she pays, pays for these get togethers that if she didn't pay for them to be with her, she'd never see them. So there's a, a touch of insecurity there. They've got three children, Johnny and Jessie have got three children, TJ, Dilly and Bridie. And Johnny is her second husband and she's got a couple of children from her first marriage. The second brother, you've got Ed and Cara. Ed is a botanist and Cara works in a hotel. She's a receptionist in a hotel. Cara, I think, is my favourite character. She is um, hung up with weight, hung up with size. She's got a very poor body image of herself and you live through her anxieties. And I, I, I do like Cara. She's she's my favourite character. And then you've got Liam and Nell. And Liam is, he was a runner and now he's a cyclist. And Nell is his second wife. And she's quite a bit younger than him, a lot younger than him. And she is coming to terms with married life, being with Liam, and wondering whether married life is all it's cracked up to be. Now, the book starts with Johnny's 50th birthday party. And Cara has had a knock on the head. She's had a, an accident. She's had a knock on the head, but she's saying, oh, she's fine. I mean, actually, she's suffering from a bit of concussion because at this birthday party, she lets out all the family secrets and creates mayhem. So that's your first chapter. And then the book goes backwards. It goes back six months, five months, and you get six months before the party, five months. And it's building up gradually to the party to all these revelations that Carla makes and you can see how everything fits together and how the families all merge, argue, everything that goes in with this dysfunctional family. So it goes back, you, you lead up to the birth, 50th birthday party and then the aftermath. You've got lots of other characters as well. You've got the family of Jesse's first husband, the Kinsellas. You've got Liam's uh, first wife, Paige, and his two daughters. 
you've got um, a, a, a refugee, Perla and her daughter, and you've got Nile's best friend, Gar. You've got all these other characters. And it's a lovely family saga. I It's the first time I've read Marion Keys. It's the first time I've delved into one of her dysfun dysfunctional families. And I loved it. I, I did enjoy it. Uh, my favourite characters, as I said, it was Cara. Uh, second one is Nell. But the girls come out much stronger than the fellas. The, the boys, they are... I don't know. That they're not very good role models, I don't think, the three guys, the three brothers. And you root for the girls. But is that because I'm a woman reading it with the fellas? If a man was reading it, would he switch? Who knows? So that is Grown Ups by Marion Keys. If you like the video, give me a like, subscribe and uh, happy reading. I'll see you next time.